this now. I want to go out for a good chop. I am a dumba. Keke. Did you watch him and Petro? How? You look with it and I can answer. Look at the other side of the inside. I have to put a Creator <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, <laughs> You'll be looking nice. So ndukunzo wakufara kuti wejira asimuka. It's not about me. It's about the whole team of Mashingo Province. Saka wejira asimuka. I give all the credit uh, to our officer commanding Mashingo Province. Wakatita kuti tuye opano nyangwe shunu shanga shaka oma. Shaka kutu rengwe kadi kuti mugadzire madrezi mavira. And in that for this dress, you can see that there are mixed one material. Yaka siyana siyana. There are two three types of material: panels, panel this, panel then the national uh, dress, red or Java. So I can do two or two days. Shit. Masho kwenye kuni mangu madimai, e kumashingo ndiye kuti kudi. Varungo tia kuna mari, varuma wasku tipa mari ndiye kuti kudi. Masho kwenye. Awa mari riko. Maria Kazara, and funga inyaye kuti this event uh, yakarongwa on a short notice. But the days anga sirizo, we shiranga shizo ita shaka kura kudarika ish. Saka ndino kuru zirama wa mazimai, ini ndino enda kubasa. Ndino shanda kuzet PCS, I'm the second officer in charge mashingo remand prison. But ndino wana time yeku balancesa. Kuterera shepaka mani yaka introduce wana Commissioner General Wedu Wajida wati tisango rilaya nema salaries But tiwane shumwe shuno ti supporta kutu wati murizedu ziendeke Saka ndi nofara bugozi, saka ndi zizi saku balanzisa Between work, nepaka mani, ne shumwe shaka ndi kumbereza Saka I'm so happy and I also encourage other women to do likewise Saka shwa chinja seo penyo inyo? Ayo wa mnongo ona my last born may be older than you. My last born is an RGN. I'm just four, I'm turning 49 on the 5th of October. So I'm not going to have a marriage. I'm not going to have a marriage. I'm not going to Okay, 
Secretary for Finance, Women's League, Mai Mukabe. National Secretary for Commissariat, Senator Boa. Secretary for External Relations, Mrs. Kaseke. Secretary for Information, Honorable Mutingwa. Newly elected a member of parliament. Honorable Mashonga Nika, newly elected Shekare, what is secretary where Women's League Indigenization? Pano Tinema, Deputy Commissioner, all Sari Pano. As the Kendra Gepsia, Deputy Commissioner General, MC Maniwi. My senior officers from government departments, Osa Aripano. Eh, Pano Tina Mayimpov. Advise Hans Mayimpov. We Pakaman Simpai. My Indanga, Aripano, my Sibandas, ZDF, my Sigauke, ZNA. My Moyo AFZ, my Matanga ZRP. National Coordinator, we do a office. National Coordinator, Pakamani, at Wakanga, we women's club. This is the first. H Metro ZPCS, Provincial Chair Lady, Mrs. Marangi. Tino Tenda. You <laughs> It starts from here. Shanya, you can find it up. You know, my my Edward, think that my inmates. Vanessa, what are some other nations? What are some other nations? What are some other as soon as you want to feel out, they are part of us. No Pamaka for Napa. Well, I'm to move on and so on. Swap Suki, what you see. Also, on a moon, I'm not that much soon. Get it out in the room. As Mukua Bata Pan, Setagango Fanana, Nasifari, was Kanama in Miss, and the Rain Bay in Asia Mukit, which is the son who bat up in Maoko. Mukabuda, Mr. Sweda, Munita, Rakawanda, one who was is there from you. They put up a single Kanganese, the money they were waiting at him, stroking out in the Gita Chagana. Any years of steam truck in the room. She told him, Sakan, you put up in the day, Messi. I feel honored and humbled today to join the Zimbabwe Prison and Correctional Services. Family at the occasion of the inaugural Pagamani Simkai Women's Club National Exhibition Day. This event is special to me because it is the first official 
activity we are undertaking as the Women's League following the harmonized elections, which saw the re-election of our iconic leader, His Excellency President Dr. E. D. Munangamba, and his subsequent inauguration, as well as the election of members of parliament and councillors, and the subsequent appointments that we witnessed. We chose you today because you play a crucial role in molding our behavior and more so you constitute part of our security services, our peace, reconciliation and security depends on you. We have not told you this before. We hold you dear. You are special to us. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, today's event provides a platform to celebrate women as a gender, their successes and resilience. The mere recognition of what it takes to empower women and the benefits derived thereof. The inclusion of women in the socio-economic arena is buttressed by the carefully selected theme of today's event, which reads, Embrace Equality for Total Empowerment. Kanatayenzana, equality. Kanatayenzana, it's not going to be the same. Abaranosa, total empowerment. Unezla, kosha unokona. Aunga <laughs> I saw you, It can be safely concluded that empowering women is indistinguishable to empowering the whole nation for development and prosperity. What we are witnessing today is a true testimony to this effect, as supported by the wise words from a famous writer. Behavioral Science Academy and Philanthropist Steve Marabon and I quote, the empowered woman is powerful beyond measure. Yes. <laughs> it's beyond measure. You are empowered and beautiful beyond description. Ladies and gentlemen, I highly proud and appreciate the women empowerment initiatives that are being undertaken by Zimbabwe Prisons and Correctional Services, ZPCS, through the Commissioner General, who is the patron of Pakaman Simkai Women's Club. I don't know whether he is here. I don't know whether he is here. I don't know whether he is here. I don't know whether As a result of these efforts, women cooperate and engage in income generating projects whose impact continues to change and sustain their livelihoods. I applaud you, Commissioner General, for rolling out this wonderful developmental program. It is a positive step step in the right direction in showing your unwavering support towards His Excellency President Dr. E.T. Munangagwa's vision 
of attaining an upper middle income by year 2030, leaving no one and no place behind. Please give yourselves a big round of applause for such a noble Tama, 
I was briefed that your membership includes female inmates. To be honest, I am overwhelmed with this initiative as it reflects your commitment and contribution to the total socio-economic empowerment for every woman by 2030 and beyond. We need to uphold this hard-working spirit and continue to cooperate so that we achieve more for our lives and families. Encourage others to embark on these life-sustaining projects. Leave no one behind. In the same vein, I applaud the various women-oriented projects that are being initiated by the First Lady, Her Excellency Dr. Amai Oksili Amnangakwa, throughout the country. Let us emulate her good work. I have seen Matimai Abatrema, Namai Wachigazila, and Dishwash, eh, from Bath, eh, Vaseline and everything. Wachina Kuti Tita Meku Bakare.
I urge you to fully utilize this platform to reflect on your achievements, identity, opportunities through interacting, and identify what you may need to keep cope from others, and networking with others. Share ideas and proffer solutions to some of the challenges that you are encountering. I have realized that you have a lot of potential to come up with innovative ideas, even the co composition of your membership in your displays. I therefore urge you to continue working in unison so that you succeed in your endeavors. <coughs> Indeed, I was quite captivated by the exhibitions that I saw at various stands. You are doing a wonderful job, and I have no hesitation to say that you are all victors in your undertakings. Remain resolute and aspire to achieve more as opportunities are at your disposal. Let this maiden exhibition be a regular event and please allow our presence today to be the beginning of a strong foundation for more engagements, interactions and collaborations. Next year we expect to see new and more as well as a positive progression from what we have observed today. May I take this opportunity to congratulate you all for coming and participating at this auspicious and inaugural showcasing event. Allow me to applaud those who have excelled and were honored with, are going to be honored with accolades. To those who could not make it, do not despair and take this as a learning curve to improve and challenge for honors in the ensuing edition. Ladies and gentlemen, with these remarks, may I once again express my gratitude to Commissioner General Tiwoku and the entire ZPS, PCS family for affording the Women's League the opportunity to grace this opportunity. Important occasion. I might of keep up the good works of gu uh, guiding and leading your team for the total empowerment of women. I wish you all the best as we embrace equality for the betterment of women in the ZPCS and the country at large. Family Thank you.